Welcome back to the battlefield, my warriors. This is Dark Sin of Legend playing Naruto Shippuden Ultimate Ninja Storm 3. Uh, welcome back to ep <coughs> excuse me. Welcome to episode six of my Legend uh, Mode playthrough mini series that goes alongside of my main story. Basically, what I do here is I go and play Legend Mode uh, to show you the difference between Legend and Hero because I do Hero Mode on my playthrough, um, my actual story playthrough. Uh, I also skip cutscenes and stuff between and uh, before, between and after battles, and just show you the battles. Um, if you guys are interested in the story, I encourage you to go watch my playthrough. I always enjoy the support, and I think I really do a really good job. Uh, hopefully, you guys do too. Um, but yeah, so I'm doing these separate videos with Legend Mode here, and I hope you guys enjoy. This is going to be the boss battle with the Ghetto Statue called the Rumbling Coast. I hope you guys aren't spoiling yourselves either and just coming in watching the boss battles or something because really it is worth it to watch the entire story. Although after it's all said and done it's always nice to go back and play these boss battles again because they're just so amazing. They're really worth it. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. So heads up here, um, Legend and Hero. Uh, this is th this fight right here is actually where they start getting pretty uh, diverse in the difficulty. If I remember correctly, the difficulty at the very last fight goes up to eight instead of ten. But you know, whatever. Difficulty eight is still pretty difficult, um, and the uh, play styles get diverse enough. Uh, I usually read these for you, but I'll just show you the um, options here instead because I do that uh, read read it uh, on my playthrough. But another thing I have to let you guys know is uh, that I kind of suck at this boss fight, like, really badly. I usually do really awesome the first half, because this boss only has two bars, as you can see. Um, but I usually do really awesome for the first bar, and then for the second bar, I really suck it up. So, be prepared, because I'm really bad at dodging the, this guy's attacks. For, uh, for now, I'm able to pretty much beat him down, and, uh, you know... I'm pretty much able to beat him down without giving him a chance to attack me, but, uh... Or, yeah, I guess I just drink, drinks myself then, because uh, he actually did attack me, and... Let's chase him again, come on. Don't want him to do any of his, <laughs> any of his attacks. He has electrical field-based attacks, and I don't like them. I, I really have a hard time dodging them. And it's not like the the controls or anything. The controls are pretty pretty good, but uh, but um, I just have a hard time uh, like predicting them and actually using the controls. I'm just gonna try to keep ramming into him and stuff and hope he, hope he doesn't uh, get the chance to attack me. Because that's really bad when that happens. I'm really bad at uh, dodging his attacks. And yeah, he does that roar which gets me away from him, so... Alright, that was pretty close. I almost got hit by that, I didn't know it was coming. But luckily I didn't dash, so everything's all good. Darn it. I thought I was going to be able to hit him in enough time. Darn it. And that stuns me. So, yeah, then you can just keep doing that. Ooh, he came right to me. Uh, ooh, yeah, and I'm able to get him too. Uh, this is the best I've ever done in this boss fight. Awesome. And I think that's game. I think.
Yeah, that's it. That's game. Here we go. Final sequence. Alright. I don't know if that's going to be enough to get me a good rank on this boss fight, but at least uh, it's a lot better than I've done. If only I could dodge it as well on that as I do on the secret action, uh, the uh, quick time event sequences. <laughs> but all I have to do is put in a few button commands. Uh, well, then again, I have to do is put in a few button commands to do anything else in the game anyway. But you know what I mean. Um, I don't have to worry about reaction time or what uh, or what uh, attack he's going to choose. I just have to do what the buttons tell me. Alright, so that was the boss fight um, with the ghetto statue, uh, the rumbling coast. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching again, guys, and I'll see you next time.